With the new medical health clinic and wellness center due to be completed by April 2015, the District of Chetwin continues to look for doctors, as does most of British Columbia. We're, we're in much of this uh, same situation as any other community across Canada. We're all fishing in the same pool, and that pool is a little smaller than it should be. But it's, a, it's, it's tough, and, and I don't mean to sound on the negative side of things, but there's 600 jobs, just under 600 jobs in BC right now for doctors. And that's probably a conservative number. There's, it's probably up over 1,000. So it's a, tough, it's a tough road to hoe, right? Um, and it's, I don't see an end in sight. Only 60% of doctors in BC are Canadian trained, and from that, only 20% come from British Columbia. And with International Avenue shrinking and the average age of doctors going up, the problem could get worse. But Chetwin City Council is working hard to bring family physicians to the community, starting with a new medical clinic. The new uh, facility will certainly accommodate uh, the type of practice that we uh, want to see in Chetwin. It's super exciting. Um, and I think the efficiencies that will be gained from having uh, each doctor having two uh, examination rooms and being set up so that they can just do what a doctor does, move from room to room and, and focus on the patient. But a new medical center can only do so much. Doctors in BC and Canada have to want to come to a town like Chetwind. And that is what council is working on. Doctors is like recruiting any other type of professional. You have to make your community appear more desirable than somebody else's community. We got our, our, our face out there, we got lots of business cards, we have some contacts that people want to come up and visit Chetwin. That was one of the things that we uh, handed out on our uh, a little card that they could fill in, was saying, would you like to come to Chetwin? So we've got some people that want to come, so we have to uh, make, them, make it available that they, they can come up. The um, idea that recruiting is not my job or somebody else's job, it's all of our jobs. And once you get past recruiting, there's this idea about retaining. And when we, get, we want to retain someone, then really, it's all of our responsibility to make our town as attractive, as friendly, as welcoming, as open as possible. Reporting for Chet TV, I'm Callie Warren.